Command and Communications, or C2, vehicles provide critical situational awareness for ground commanders and accompanying forces so most modern armies of the world field some form of the type. This is why, in the 1970s, Japanese Ground Self-Defense Force JGSDF, authorities commissioned for such a vehicle. While both 4x4 and 6x6 vehicles were trialed, the 6x6 form was the preferred model. Further work resulted in the Type 82 Command and Communications Vehicle which still serves the JGSDF today, 2017. The 6x6 wheeled nature of the design offers the needed cross-country mobility required of for the role. The road wheels selected are large and give excellent ground clearance. Atop the framework is a simple lightly armored superstructure housing a standard operating crew of three. Defense is from a simple arrangement of 1 by 12.7 mm heavy machine gun. Later models offer a remote firing feature for this weapon, and 1 by 7.62 mm medium machine gun. Dimensions include an overall length of 5.72 meters, a width of 2.48 meters, and a height of 2.37 meters, sans the roof mounted armament fit. Combat weight registers 13,500 kilograms. The hull superstructure is completed with a driver's compartment, seated front right, at the front and large window panel sporting built in, fold down protective plates, vision slits provided in this mode. Over the roof are installed various hatches for the remaining crew. The superstructure presents angled facings for basic ballistics protection from small arms fire and artillery spray. Over the rear of the vehicle is seated the oversized section of the hull superstructure. The engine was positioned along the left side of the hull with a tunnel giving forward a rear access for the crew. A large door is fitted to the rear hull face for quick embarking and disembarking and the left side of the hull has another point of entry and exit. Various positions about the hull have vision ports doubling as firing ports should the crew need to defend their vehicle. No NBC, nuclear, biological, chemical, system is fitted by default though the driver is given access to night vision equipment for low light operations. Power for the design stems from an Isuzu 10 PBI water-cooled diesel engine developing 305 horsepower at 2, 700 rpm. Maximum road speed is 100 kmh with an operational range out to 500 km. The vehicle can ford water sources up to 1 meter deep and conquer obstacles up to 0.6 meters tall. Trench crossing is limited to 1.5 meters wide and the vehicle is able to traverse gradients up to 60%, 30% side slopes. An initial batch of 10 vehicles was provided to the JGSDF in 1982, and the service sought as many as 250 units in all. Komatsu was responsible for manufacture of the vehicles which eventually totaled 231.